All right, what's going on, boys? Welcome back to the next episode of starting every Black Ops 3 map on Route 100 and getting Route 101. Today, I have my favorite map in BO3, my second favorite map of all time. I have Moon, but also with a twist, because I've seen a lot of comments saying, this would be super hard if you didn't start with 50K points. All right, so for this, I mean, I could try to dump off all my points, but that's gonna be a lot of effort. So I'm not allowed to go under 50K points. Also, I did test this to see if it would actually work correctly with the mod because you know, you have no man's land and you have the starting around a hundred. So there's just a lot of things going on. So because of that, once you go back to the uh, actual moon itself and you, oh my God, the lag yet again, sorry for the lag before the timer goes down. But once I go to the moon, it takes away all of my points and resets me back to 50k. So there's no point in getting extra points here. So I'm just going to get Jug and then go. All right, so let's get Jug. Let's get out of here. Yet again, I know this is kind of like starting with a little something, but not a big deal, man. It's for what we're doing. It's fine. All right, so I'm going to let it reset me to 50k before I prone in front of Quick Revive so I can get the extra 100. Come on. Just do your thing, game. All right, there we go. All right, so there. I'm on round 100. I have 50,000 points that I'm just going to pretend aren't there. So now I need to complete this by getting like the RK5, getting the Shiva, racking up a bunch of points, pack a bunch in those, get dead wire and turned hopefully, and then survive. So since I have 30 seconds that I can't do anything with with the grace timer, first off, as always, if you enjoy any of my videos, please consider leaving a like on the video and subscribing. I'd really appreciate support. Thank you all so much for your support. Thank you all so much for 10k subs. That is absolutely insane. Can't believe I'm here saying that. And daily question, what is better, BO3 Moon or BO1 Moon? BO3 Moon is the, like, the only map that I will say just severely benefited from Chronicles. It is the only map that I felt like was remastered in BO3 and deserved it because it deserved a better engine. Like, I've talked about how most maps feel like they belong in the game they're in. Like, BO2 Origins is better than BO3 Origins because, like, for one, you can just seriously tell that origins is meant to be a bo2 map transit's the only other map i can really think of off the top of my head that really needed a better engine oh my god uh. all right now i need to get 1250 points to open the door get the rk5 and start racking other points which actually i could grenade uh that's probably the smarter option to actually just get some points it won't kill but it could give me some points for hitting zombies yeah let me know your thoughts on bo3 versus bo1 moon down below i still love bo1 moon it's still one of my favorite bo1 maps but you could tell that it kind of needed a better engine to hit its full potential, if that makes sense. Ow, whoa, he is... Oh, the zero gravity so hard to maneuver. Dude, he just went sicko mode. You see how fast he was swinging? It was just bop, 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 bop. It was like, holy shit, what's he doing? So yeah, I have to knife my way to 1250. I'm just saying 1250 because we're just pretending the 50K is not there. So I got to knife my way to that. Actually, it's probably a good way to do this. So I'm going to get to 1250 by the rk5 rack enough points with the rk5 that when i swing back under to come back in the spawn room i can get the shiva and then rack a bunch of points with those go on a little ammo runs and then i'll actually i'll go back to no man's land once i can because i can rack points there like there's no point in racking them here when on no man's land i think i can kill them because they'll have round one health for a while and then like round two round three but it's better than round 100 health i still haven't gotten one flawless even though yet again the giant and kino i would have gotten if i didn't add a big twist so let's try to get this one flawless this needs to be the one so i'm gonna hold here so more of them come over here let me rack 500 too while i'm at it you need to hold this position so they don't like stampede you on that other door when you get there all right there's my 500 come on hurry up Give me the Shiva, because I want these to get AATs on to actually get the thing. Let me through without any questions. All right, cool. See, I held that bottom of the staircase there, so that way they wouldn't be, like, crowding that other door. So I do need to rack a lot of points, and then I need to just not choke the game. That's kind of just it. Oh, that zero G bounce. Woo! I had, like, an extra little bounce that killed my momentum and stuck me down. Oh, my God. Dude, oh, I need to get quick before I forget. Also, if I go down, I can't get Jug again because Moon's just like that. Yeah, but I thought it would be fun because I think on each single one of these I've done, which I've done, what? Origins, Kino, The Giant, Ascension. Okay, wait, I did do it on Garage Kirby too. So Origins, Kino, GK, The Giant, Ascension. I did do it on Call of the Dead Remastered too, but that doesn't count. So I've done, what, five of the 14 maps? I forget. I think I had an original point to that. But I just forgot it because I'm just, I was distracted because I couldn't remember. I knew I did another one. I just couldn't remember. And I was like, oh, GK, I forgot. Okay, well, I'm out of ammo. I only have 4250 points to burn. I'll do another, like, entire ammo, like, point rack session. <laughs> ammo point rack. Another point rack session with one more ammo grab. 
Oh, you... Bitch, that one zombie. What was he doing there? <laughs> I held that staircase for a while, too, and he's still just... It was one dude. Like, why is he so much faster than everyone else? He's like the kid in elementary school that's going try hard around the track at recess to impress the girls. And by that one kid, I mean every boy in elementary school. Because... I did the same thing because I used to be really fast, especially in elementary school. I think I was like the second or third fastest kid in the grade and then I got fat, but now I'm not fat anymore. But now I haven't run in a while because I just lift weights. So I'd probably still be, actually, no, I wouldn't be that slow. I mean, even with lifting, you do gang athletic ability. Not as much as if you train for athletic. I'm wow. Such a weird side tangent just because I made one joke. Actually, before I go, I might have to make another ammo run. So I actually have ammo to kill. The zombies on the no man's land area with i mean the smarter thing would be sit here and point rack like this for a while actually i might have to just oh i might have to be safe because i want to pack a bunch as soon as i get to the uh, no man's land because i don't want to pack a bunch and by the point i pack a bunch they're too strong to you know really do anything with okay i, I just need to be smart i'll try to cut to when i have like i don't know 70k cut again okay well i'll show that it, it, the exact same situation again one zombie bro one I'll show that too. That was scary. Uh, jumping around in zero G is scary. All right, yeah, that's close enough. Twenty K. So let's get going. I'm gonna go to pack a punch. I need to rack points there. Uh, uh, can I? Thank you. All right, let's go. So now I want to try to get the right AATs because I only have one chance. Uh, while I'm there, I only have one chance to go to the spawn or not the spawn. Well, I mean, it is the spawn, but. No man's land. I can't say no man's land today. I don't know. I keep saying everything but. Hey, sir. Because once I go once, it has to reset. No, I don't want double. I do want double. I, but I want... Ah, shit. I, <laughs> let's go pack a punch. Let's go get AATs. And then I just have to survive. I just have to not choke. I get both the weapons pack a punched. Because they are low health. So, come on, cancel it out. Oh, I canceled it too much. Wait, guys. Chill. Let me just have it. Chill. All right, cool. Uh, I want speed? Even though, eh? Ah, I shouldn't have done that. I mean, whatever. Oh, they're around 100 health. Oh. Oh, my God. Hilarious. Don't touch me. Well, that just threw a giant wrench in the plan. Uh-oh. I got to get AATs fast. I got to get... I might only get one hit per. For some reason, I thought their health was going to reset, but it did not. Oh, I'm so close. Come on. Can I get it from this side? Woo! All right, come on. Get out of there. Just give me a turn. I want to turn on the Shiva. Fireworks. All right. I actually might just have to stick with what I get. Please just give me dead wire on the RK5. I want a dead wire RK5 turned Shiva. That was the hope. Blast. Please give me dead wire here or turned, I guess. Stop. It's freaking dogs, dude. Oh my god. Please don't hurt me. Double firework. Fireworks break the windows and spawn. Like, it actually doesn't matter if it does, but. Does it? We're gonna put the RK5 back in. Please give me dead wire on it. I want turn on the Shiva, but it's not worth trying. I don't know how I've done such a good thank you. I've done a really good job at making sure I don't go under 50k. Do I try one more for turned? Let's try it. Screw it. Alright, come on. Turned. It's gonna give me Thunderwall and I'm gonna cry. Don't do it to me. I see you, dog. You <laughs> knew it i want to get stam but i need to be careful to not lose all my ammo and not have enough points because i need to be able to buy like one round of rk5 ammo again where is cosmonaut by the way what's he been up to and i also i'm gonna have not a great indication of when i'm gonna be done because i've already got kills i mean i'll end it with like a thousand eighty kills that'll kind of be my indication i guess so now i just need to get enough points to go get stam and then i need to not mess this up which i just don't mess it up come on dude you, you got this thunderwall thank you Ooh, see there we go nice something's wrong with the spawns they are spawning at a aggressively slow rate. Something's wrong. I think the round 100 mod has broken the spawns. They, they should be spawning way faster than this. That aim assist was crazy. I tried aiming down there, but I aimed at one as he jumped. And it aim assisted onto him and I went, woo! Yeah, something's wrong with the spawns in here. And I don't know why they're so slow. I mean, yet again, when you have No Man's Land with a mod that starts you on round 100, like a lot of weird things going on, I guess. And right, let's just go get Stam, because why not? I mean, maybe the spawns are faster in here. Let's see... The spawns are faster in here. I'll just hang out here, even though it's just such a bad idea. I shouldn't be doing that, but oh, especially when I run out of ammo. Okay, I almost mind blanked. I was like, do I have enough points for this? Wait, so the spawns in here are fine. What happened in spawn room? Why are they so slow? That's not right. Okay, am I hanging out in here? Oh my. 
That was such a fast down. Cool, guys. That was... Oh, my God. Now I can't get Jug again. No, we're just playing with that Jug now. Yeah, you haven't gotten one for that this year. Maybe this will be the one gift out of this. <laughs> Shut up, dude. Okay, now I actually am in a precarious situation. I have to go get Quick Revive back. Uh, and they're all coming through there. I'm not going to be able to peacefully do that. No, don't touch me. Don't. I don't have Jug. Don't touch me. God, you guys are so slow. They're still slow. What's going on with the spawns, bro? It's really weird. They're just not spawning at a normal rate. And I don't understand why. Oh, God. Oh, something's broke them. They're broken. I broke the zombies. I broke cause zombies, not clickbait. Crazy. Co uh, not comma, parentheses, insane. You know, something is legitimately weird with the spawns. They're just not spawning at normal rates. Like, look, look at this. Oh god, dude, there should be so many more. What is going on? I mean, it's still gonna be intense because I don't have Jug because I'm just a giant idiot, but what is going on with the spawns? I just can't reiterate it enough. It's just broken. It is broken. BO3 Moon is easily my favorite high round map on this game. Because with Moon, like, you have, like, pattern interrupts. You have Excavator, you have Cosmonaut, which, where is he? Hello? Cosmonaut boy, hello? Even though I could just deadwire him, it's just, like, where is he? But yeah, instead of just, you know, running the high round strategy with, like, no interruptions, the Excavators really force this pattern interrupt where you have to think, dude. Why was he over there? I mean, I'm holding here. They should be funneling over here. I'm just doing my very best to just choke this away. I... I lost Jug in such a stupid way. Now I'm struggling over here because I'm an idiot. But I heard a noise. Did I just burst the window? Oh no, that was just a weird texture glitch. Wait, what What the hell? If you look at the rock, the, like, thing in the windows is gone. Like, the, um, that, like, kind of cross pattern. Yeah, I easily think Moon is my favorite high round map in this game, too. I mean, there's a lot of maps in this game that I really like, but I don't like how they function for high rounds, like DE. DE high rounds just suck, in my opinion, but Moon... It's just fun from start to finish. DE is super fun in the beginning. Like, the bows are cool. The setting's cool. It's a great map. It's a, I have it in my S tier. It's my fifth favorite map of all time. But there are certain maps that just high rounds. Just, they aren't fun on there. Like, GK is really bad. Grog Kirby high rounds are just awful. I'm trying to think of another map where doing the whole I have zero points thing would be better. Because it was really easy in this starting room. Because it was really easy to point rack in here. I mean, what I have left. Oh, God. Oh, no. Dude, I am just choking so hard. You know, while I have an endpoint, just go buy ammo. Wait, I still have a gobble gum hit. Oh, God. Well, I mean, I do, but if I can get there. Yeah, I'm just choking. Every time I play zombies right when I wake up, it just goes poorly. Just absolutely awful. Please, anywhere but here, because apparently I need more escapes because I just suck. It could be Alchem. It's Alchem. Oh, my God. Okay. Yeah, Zombies is one of those games where you... I mean, it's any game, actually. For some reason, I always thought Zombies was one of the games you didn't need a warm-up game, but it really is. For some reason, a warm-up game matters so much in this. For some reason, when you think of a warm-up game, you really only think of, like, PvP games, you know, multiplayer, where you're playing against other players, but it really is all games. Like, if you don't have a good warm-up for Zombies, you just throw away the game like me. I mean, I'm just... I'm trying my hardest to just throw it away. Man, it feels so nice to be on BO3 Moon again, though, because I have not played BO3 Moon for probably a year, because I just don't play Zombies off recording. Because if I start playing a bunch of Zombies off recording, I would probably be burnt out to play it on recording, which I want to be fresh on recording and not you know not in the mood to play the game because then it wouldn't be as nice which that was clean to not get hit there and then i jump right against the horde and i should have died oh my what am i doing oh my god there's so much going on yeah so i haven't played moon in probably a year because actually it would be 10 months because i was playing a lot of bo3 moon right before i started my channel because right before i started the channel i started really getting into zombies again i kind of took a little break where i was playing it intermittently but i wasn't playing it that much and then i came back i was like doing a bunch of bo3 moon and bo3 kino high rounds without double pack a bunch and without jug and without other stuff and then i started the channel and then now I'm here. See, it feels so nice to come back. You know, this is really nice, this series. Starting on round 100, I'm going to come to every BO3 map because there's a lot that I haven't played in a while. Oh, dude. I don't want to play Zet. I don't want to play Zet. I don't remember how you play that map. It was really funny because in the first one of these I did on Origins, I was like, if this gets something crazy, like 500 likes, it's at like 5.5k or something right now. It's over 5k. I was like, if I get over 500, oh, I'll play Zetsubo. And then I could really tell people wanted this to be a series. So then I was like, well, I'll play Zetsubo at some point. I'll get there. I just 
I don't remember how to play. Like, if I had to go do a normal setup on there, I'd suck and just mess it up. Like, oh, what do you mean? I have to start on around 100. I don't know what I'm doing. So, yeah, that's why I've kind of just been putting it off. I'm like, I said I'd play it, and I'm going to play every single BO3 map with this. So, we'll get there eventually. How'd I not slide? How, bro? I'm... Boys, I'm choking. I'm throwing the game so hard. How did I not slide? What the... Why did my slide not go through? I... Mmm, whatever. I'm going back to the stamina up room anyway. Whatever. You know what? Screw it. The, f the spawns were a little bit faster in there for some reason, and I need stamina, so I'm just going to go here stay here. Never mind, I'm almost out of RK5 ammo. I'm not going to sit here and rely on Thunderwall, because this recharge is just too slow. Man, I wish I just still had fireworks. Fireworks would have been fine. See, look at... What are... Why are the spawns cooler in here? That's not how Moon is supposed to work. The spawn room is supposed to be one of the better spawn areas. Okay, Thunderwall sucks as is, but without double tap, it's taking forever to activate. Oh my god, dude. Oh, insta red, insta red, insta red. Ouch. Owie. Ouch. Don't do that again. There's a lot of weird stuff going on in this game. Like, the spawns are just messed up. Um, I feel like I'm dropping frames. I think the round 100 mod mixed with moon's mechanics itself was not the ideal map to mix it with like i kind of can just tell from how the game is playing because these spawns are not as quick as they should be dude what am i doing just getting continuously red like where are the zombies it's oh perfect time regen like it's messing up how i hoard because i'm expecting zombies to be here because i've played so much bo3 moon i'm so used to like where they spawn at certain times and it's just not the normal rate from the normal positions so it's messing up all my prior, you know, muscle memory of the map. And all this game has taught me so far is Thunderwall is still by far the worst AAT. Even when it activates. Like, it takes so long to do that. Thanks, man. But, you know, Deadwire can kill the same amount of zombies and have an instant reset. Like, are you kidding me? Bro, are there any Thunderwall lovers out here? I'm curious, dude. There's no way. Bro, I don't have Jug. I just keep getting red so fast. Look who decided to show up, boys. What? Hello. Oh, right, now I'm going to try to kill the cosmonaut without dying. Come on. Thank you, Thunderwall. Nice. Oh, it just popped me into the one zombie that Thunderwall didn't get. No. 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 Stop. Quit it. Thank you. I'm just perpetually ret... I'm throwing the game. I'm throwing. I'm just perpetually... Re what, what am I doing, dude? Oh, my God. I don't have any more quicks. I have burnt all of my quick revives somehow like an idiot. No, I'm not going... Oh, I don't have a, an escape gun. Well, I am out of chances. I've thrown the game so hard that I burnt all of my chances. I have no escape gun. I have no quick out. Oh my... Fucking, oh my god. Well, now I'm like halfway done. I've literally burnt every freaking quick out I could have had. Every escape. All the gobble gum that would have gave me a quick escape. Don't have anything else. No quick revives. Nothing. <laughs> Oh my god, what am I doing? I've... Boys, I have actually thrown this game so hard. You know, something I have noticed, rather than the DE camo decides my perks video, is I've just been playing worse lately. And I know that used to happen to me a lot when I high rounded, is that there would be like a two or three week period where I would play super well, where I was so fast at setting up, I was not taking stupid downs, and then I'd have a couple weeks where I just couldn't play well, and I would, like, keep downing on, like, 80. And I think I'm in the middle of one of those can't play the game well periods for some weird reason. I guess they still exist for me. These last couple weeks, I just... I have not been playing well. I don't know. Let me know if you guys kind of have that because... Oh, God. It happened to me back when I used to not even have videos, obviously, before I did YouTube and all that. And it's still happening now. I don't know what it is. It's like a down slump period. In the DE, uh, Pack-a-Punch decides my perk, or Pack-a-Punch camo decides my perk. I played pretty well. I made a lot of stupid mistakes, got myself caught, and I just managed to hit Gobble Gum in time. I don't know. These last couple weeks, I just have not been playing the game well. Mmm, what'd I get caught against? Hello? Must have clipped that freaking crate right there or something. That was close. Oh, wait. Oh, Quick Arrive still has a little bit of a hitbox there, doesn't it? I can feel like the groove of the perk yeah well, oh god it is there i keep running into it it's really messing me up because i just don't expect it to be there and i keep running into its hitbox so it's just it's really screwing me over nope nope no i'm so close to being done oh god nope no nope. <laughs> no is that it oh shh 
Jeez. Okay. There we go. I did it. Oh, it's a 50 minute recording. God, the spawns were so busted. I'm sorry. I guess you can't do anything about it. Anyway, boys, I hope you enjoyed this. If you enjoyed it, please consider leaving a like on the video and subscribing. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.